All right, this video is how to use your timer in your clock in your clock application on your iPhone. First of all, you got to open it up. When it opens up, you're going to go down to the bottom and you're going to see you got world clock, you got alarm, you got bedtime, you got stopwatch. I've already clicked on it. If I go like this, here's stop, here's the stopwatch. Let's go back and I'm going to click on timer. Bam. So now we're in the timer. All right, and I've got it set for three minutes and two seconds. But let's go ahead and let's just bring this down to zero. So I got that, I got the minutes at zero because you know, I, I don't wanna make the, vid, the video a million. I'm gonna put this at three seconds. So what's, what it's gonna do is uh, when I click this start, in three seconds it's gonna give us an alarm and tell us that you know, if we're cooking something or if we're you know, letting uh, something uh, timing something, uh, it's going to let us know that that time has gone by. So I'm going to go ahead and click that start, and you get this little thing, and then it goes. I don't know if you can hear it. <laughs> I got to turn it off. And then to get rid of it, you just go like that. All right now, if you want to change your alarm, I've got it set on the default, which is radar. But if I click here, we can change that alarm by just going like this. So let's go to let's go to bulletin, all right? And let's set that. All right, so now it's set at bulletin. So let's try it again. Can you hear it? <laughs> Cancel. All right, get that out of there. All right, so I want to go back and put it back to radar. All right, set. All right, and that's how you do that. Um, for some reason, it's not ringing very loud. Turn it up and let's try it again. That's better. All right, so that woke us up. So you can use this, like let's say if you want to do a three minute egg, bam, there you are, three minute egg. You hit it, when it rings, you know it's time to pull it out of the water. Or let's say you want it to cook pasta and it takes uh, 11 minutes. Put it there, hit start, bam, you got your pasta. And that's how you use timer on your clock app in your iPhone. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos on how to use the clock app on your iPhone.